it is me ca welcome back to another video um and today's video is going to be a camilo x listener x carlos part two of the royal high school are you just to let you know since y'all wanted a part two <laughs> and thank you all so much for 590 subscribers like oh my god we're about to hit 600 i'm so excited like thank you all so much <laughs> anyways um this is the part two of the yukon academy high school aka her is the title so uh yeah <laughs> let's get on the video <laughs> so where we left off is that when you were at the palace and now you're being dropped off at school um you were dropped off out of school and was and was greeted by mirabelle and camilo this is Mirabelle. Oh, hey, listener. Uh, hi, listener. Yeah, you can tell about my voice changing, so yeah. Hey, listener, what's up? I uh, hope you had breakfast, because if not, then we have breakfast here in the school. Um, Mirabelle, um, I'm gonna go to my class now. It's I am about to get late. And Camilo runs off to his class. Which kind of finds you suspicious. Normally he would like greet you like in a hugging way. Being all touchy. But not like that. Just like in a friend way. You know what I mean? Friend zoned. Anyways. <laughs> this is Mirabelle. Okay. Bye Camilo. Um, if you run into any of the familia members. Uh, tell them I said hi. And Camilo just nodded and said goodbye. Anyways. So um, listener. Uh, what's your first class? math hmm i have math too what's your second one gym oh sad i can't really go to gym yet uh, well i'll guide you to the math class since you're still new about it so let's go um you and mirabelle go like to class together you guys sit next to each other but like mirabelle was on your left and Carlos was on your right. And yes, Carlos didn't really pay attention to you because, like, he was writing stuff down. And, like, he was sort of drawing something, but you couldn't tell. You could definitely tell it was a girl, but you couldn't tell who it was, but you didn't want to be getting into his business. So, yeah, like, respect and, like, mind your own business. So, yeah, it's basically like that. And going back to you and Mirabelle. So, listener, um, how you've been? Oh, look, I'm not really good at conversations, okay? Bear with me. Please bear with me, girlfriend. Anyways. And yes, um, the teacher was talking and all that stuff. And, uh, Carlos caught you staring at him and, like, tells the teacher... Um, teach. What is it now, Carlos? The new student, a.k.a. Princess Listener, keeps staring at me, and it's very disturbing. Didn't you have a rule about staring as rude or something? And, like, Carlos smirks at you, and, like, you just glare at him. And then this is the teacher. <sighs> we talked about this. In the last time of our schoolings, Liz, Princess Listener, please do not stare at people or do anything that is their business. Okay? Just nodded and um, kept on listening to the teacher's, uh, you know, instructions about the lesson. And this is Carlos. <laughs> I warned you. Be careful on who you're friends with. <laughs> And, like, you just glare at him. Like, straight up glare at him. But not for too long. Because, like, the teacher will notice you staring again. And, like, will literally, like, put you in attention. So, yeah. Uh, a little time skip. After the lesson, you were walking out with Mirabelle. Carlos bumps on you on purpose from behind. Oops. <laughs> sorry. Oh, no. I'm not sorry. <laughs> And this is Mirabelle. Carlos, why would you do that to her? And then this is Carlos. 
Oh, Mirabelle, you know what happened yesterday. Don't act innocent. Carlos, you better forgive her. That was just a jacket. You have, like, loads at the palace. You don't need to be so dramatic about it. Or do you just want the attention? Mirabelle likes fat facts. Yeah. And then, like, Camilo comes in. He brings that food. That water. Oh, <laughs> I'm making a sound out of that. <laughs> that food. That water. <laughs> Anyways, Carlos just rolls his eyes and leaves off with his friends. Or, like, bully friends or some shit. They're gonna go bully some nerd. Oh my god. <laughs> and, like, this is Mirabelle. I am so, so sorry about him, listener. I didn't know he would be such an asshole to you on your second day. And, yeah, um, he's a part of our family with Camilo and, you know. <laughs> so, you and Mirabelle walk over to cafeteria and, like, to get some snacks, I guess, to eat. And then, like, some girl, like, comes up and, like, starts making fun of you. Oh, hey, princess listener. I heard you spilled, like... Your drink on my Carlos? Oh, it's so cringe. I'm trying. I'm trying not to cringe. I, literally, my editor's like, she's like trying to hold his laughter. <laughs> Shut up! It's not funny. Anyways, uh, continuing on. And like, this is Mirabelle. Um, chill. Anyways, uh, it was yesterday. Get over it. And it's not her fault. She was, like, a little busy. Like, she was in a rush. And then, this is the girl. Well, she should actually pay attention to her surroundings. If she wasn't so clumsy and dumb, maybe she wouldn't be enemies with my Carlos. And this is Mirabelle. Why do you keep calling him your Carlos? He doesn't have a girlfriend, yet he doesn't want one. And also, you ugly as hell. She whispers that last part. And, like, this is the bully. Um, anyways, so, what you got there? Uh, you have a tray with, um, coke or, like, some food. So, yeah. Or soup or whatever you want to name it. And, like, the girl Snickers and, like, Snickers. Snickers. <laughs> oh. The girl Snickers and, like, um, let's just say, like, she puts her hand on the bottom of the tray and, like, flips it over. For, like, the food and drink to spill all over you. And, like, everyone was, like, watching, like, <gasps> Or, like, something like that. You know what I mean? And this is the bully. <laughs> now you know how it feels to be treated like that. And, like, Mirabelle was so mad. Hey, that's not nice. Why would you do that to her? She did nothing wrong. Well, if she did that to my Carlos, she should also know how it feels. You just push the girl and, like, start fighting her. And, like, she was also fighting you back. And, like, Meter Bell was trying to, like, um, trying to pull you two apart. And then, like, Camilo comes here. Yo, what's... Ca listener? And, like, this is Meter Bell. Carla, uh, Camilo, you need to help me. I, I can't get Listener off of her. S someone help me. Why are you all chanting to go and fighting? What is wrong with you people? And everyone's, like, chanting, fight, 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 or some, like, shit. Carlos, on the other hand, was really entertained of the way you fight. He was focusing on how you looked fierce, on how you were, like, fighting, dodging her, like, punches and all. How your body moves in, like, a swift, like, he's getting a little dirty thoughts of it. And, like, he shakes his head, like, knowing that you just met him and all. Like, that, that's just stupid. Like, he, he couldn't fall in love with you. This is Carlos. What? I can't fall in love with her. She's... I can't fall in love with them. What am I saying? They're just new, Carlos. They're just going to distract you and your jobs. They're all the same girls as fucking hell. Carlos has lost in thought that he forgot that you still were fighting with a girl. And, like, this is the girl. <sighs> what is wrong with you? Why would you start throwing hands on me when I did nothing? So what if I spilled it on your clothing? At least you know how it feels for Carlos. My Carlos. And, like, Carlos heard that part and, like, is grossed out and, like, shouts this. I am not your Carlos, you disgusting fuck. And, like, the people laugh around the bully and, like, she just storms out angrily. And you know what, you know what we're gonna call her? It's the one and only Anita. <laughs>
<laughs> yes, bitch, she's back. Anita is in this AU. So, I did say that this is going to be compared to the other ones. So, yeah. <clears throat> Anyways. Anita storms off. And this is Camilo. Listener, are you okay? Just so you know, he hugs you. And, like, checks for injuries. You had, like, a bruised eye and, like, a little nosebleed. So, yeah. Oh, 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 oh God. Uh, Mirabel, let, let, let's take... Let's take her to Tia or the nurse or something. Camilo and Carlos... Well, Mirabel takes you to the nurse while Camilo stays for a bit and, like, glares at Carlos. But before then, like, leaves. Carlos just, like, looks weird at him. Like, the fuck is he glaring at? It's not my fault. But Carlos rolls his eyes after and continue on his lunch and everyone does that too. Like, nothing ever happened. Well, like, you're at the nurse and all... Um, uh, Mirabelle left you there because, like, she had to go to class, and Carlos, uh, Camilo, had no class. Why do I keep saying Carlos? <laughs> Camilo goes over to you. Hey, uh, listener, are, are you okay? Hey, it's, it's okay. No need to cry. It, it's okay. I'm here. And, like, he hugs you. It's okay, I am so sorry for what happened between you and Anita. Yeah, her name's Anita. She has a full-on obsession, a literally full-on obsession of me and Carlos. So, yeah. I'm so sorry she did that to you. And no, we're not dating. Carlos really hates her. He, he just pities her, so. Well, uh, again, I'm so sorry about what happened. I'm sorry I couldn't be there. And, like, Camilo keeps apologizing. And, like, you decide to, like, give him a kiss on the cheek to shut him up. Uh, I j I'm so sorry. Okay, I... Uh, did, did you just kiss me on the cheek? And, like, Camilo's face went red. Like, a little red. Because, like, he, he was good at hiding it. Like, he had, like... He was calm on the outside, but, like, in the inside, he's, like, a screaming mess, like, Oh, my God! So, yeah. <laughs> then you just smirk at him and, like, uh, grab his hand and drag him outside for class. But little did you know that there was a certain someone spying on the both of you and got, like, a little jealous, but ignored it, of course, and act like if nothing ever happened. And that is it for this episode too. <laughs> can you guess who was staring at you? Or like spying on you guys? If you can guess it right, I'll pin you. Okay, for the person who guessed that um for the person who guessed the person spying on you, then I'll pin that person. Literally I'll pin that person. Like I ain't even kidding no more, dog. So yeah. Just tell me who it is, and you will be pinned. Yeah, thank you all so much for watching this part two of the Camilo X, Listener X, Carlos. And again, thank you so much for 590 subscribers. I am so happy right now. Ah! Um, I'll be continuing on the Fort Town X, Listener part four. So yeah, just to let you all know. No. And don't think I forget about the original Camila X and X Carlos Part 10. Yeah, season 2 is about to start. <gasps> ah! Anyways, let's just see what happens in the future. Goodbye, my little Zodis. Stay safe. Love y'all.